Hey everyone, thanks for joining me once again for another video. So, today's video is um, kind of about a, a topic I want to bring up. And I'm going to start it off with first, um, I want to say rest in peace to Jackie Collins. I'm sure most of you have heard that um, she passed away recently, just this past week, from breast cancer. Um, apparently, um, from the reports that I read, it was metastatic cancer, so that means that it had spread. Um, I also read reports that she um, was diagnosed about six years ago, but chose to keep it very, very private. Um, so that information was never released, basically, to the world. It was never made public. And, of course, uh, she has the right to do that, as anybody does. It's your health. It's your right. So we're... That's definitely not in question. We're not even arguing that point at all. Um, I was just really sad when I read that she had passed away from breast cancer um, because cancer is so huge in our world right now. And what a magnificent voice she could have lent to um, others in the struggle, you know, on, maybe on a research basis or anything. But clearly that's not what she wanted to do. We all have our brand. We put out to the world what we want others to see and know about us and that's perfectly fine i have a brand you have a brand and um and, and so that that that's fine there's no, nothing wrong with that and so she chose not to um uh, expose release publicize her personal um story and medical history now the reason why i bring that up is because there are plenty of people out here that are also going through something real major, real heavy, real, real heavy in their life, whether it's medically related or whatever it's related to. And they're not necessarily making the choice not to put the information out there. They just don't know how or they're scared. A lot of people are operating in fear of repercussions, backlash, embarrassment, rejection. You know, yeah, you put something out there about yourself, let's say an illness and you could be rejected by people. And so, you know, one of the reasons why I started YouTube, the real reason I started YouTube is because I felt after I got diagnosed the second time, something led me to start this channel because I felt somebody needs to hear my voice. There's somebody who, let's say, is diagnosed with cancer and they don't even know where to go to turn. They're in fear. They're scared. They don't even know what questions to ask. And they're not going to put themselves out there. They're just not going to do that because of who they are. You know, and I thought, hey, if I put myself out there, offer myself up that others can learn. And so when I created this channel, I put and share with you guys that, you know, I have almost 50 videos. And in my videos, if you've watched them or if you're thinking about watching them, you know, I share about bras. I We talk about wigs. You know, I talk about and show what happened to my skin during radiation. I can't hide. I can't hide and I can't hold it hold back and obviously I don't have the platform as maybe a Jackie Collins okay I, I'm not known worldwide okay but those of us that are still around in the struggle um, if we can share and enlighten people you know send out virtual hugs and let people know they're not alone because we're going through it you know here I'm I'm walking through cancer right now and and there's many people walking with me and the only way that individuals could walk with me is if they know about it and so I just want to put that piece out there and, and kind of give you my thoughts and uh, let you know you're not alone share your story it's okay to let other people know if you have 10 good friends in your corner and you believe you tell them and they're gonna turn their back on you I'm here to tell you if there's a million people that will walk with you this world is big. There's so many people that want to love on you, walk with you, and encourage you. And um, But I also will say this. What you perceive to happen may not happen at all. Okay? Let's operate in facts, not fiction, folks. Facts, not fiction. All right? That's the message for today. You have a great day. Have a great weekend. See you soon. Take care.